Hey, lovelies. So I wanted to come on here real quick because I'm on a um, weight loss journey, healthy journey, trying to do better, y'all. So I always try to find alternatives to um, other things. So I came across this company, which I'm sure a lot of y'all probably already heard of them, Magic Spoon, but I haven't. I, um, I heard someone talking about it, but I was like, what exactly is that? So just so happened, I was on Facebook, y'all, I'm telling y'all, and it popped up. Um, across the screen I'm like okay so I ordered they had a special so I ordered some boxes okay so let me show y'all I'm gonna uh, show y'all the macros and stuff like that if y'all don't know macros are it's just the nutritional facts and stuff like that so this flavor is called frosted and I'm gonna give y'all my opinion on what um, you know in order from one to four since it's four of them or how I like them and I'm gonna give y'all my honest opinion y'all and I also have some water to uh, drink between it this is the banana muffin this is what really made me um want to try it because i seen this new flavor that they said well they said it was new like i said i haven't really heard of these you got the french toast now i don't like french toast y'all i know it's kind of weird but i really don't um eat no kind of eggs except for boiled so i don't really like stuff like that like french toast and stuff like that sorry about the glasses y'all gotta have these on because the fan makes my eyes water Okay, and then this is blueberry muffin. Okay, so how about we try frosted last because I think these might be um, the ones that might taste. I want to say <laughs> banana. Uh, I want to say the banana muffin is going to be my favorite because I just absolutely love banana bread, banana everything. But I think this is, might be the best one because of the frosting. So let's get these open. I think I'm going to do this one last. The frosted. How about we do the French toast first? Let's just do the French toast first. How about that? All right. So I'm going to open it up, y'all. I'm going to try not to hold y'all up too long. Let me know down below if y'all had these. And if so, um, do y'all like them? What's your favorite uh, flavor and stuff like this? These are the macros for the French toast, y'all. I hope y'all can see that. Okay. So I got my scissors right here. Your girl tried to come prepared today, y'all. Right, so this is what it looks like. It's pretty full, too. But, y'all, I went to Target, and these boxes was almost like $9. I was like, oh, my goodness. And I can't even remember how much I paid for these four. Uh, I'm going to try to find the receipt, and then I'll put it across the screen, okay? Smell good. As soon as I open it, it smells good. Okay. So, I got a couple right here. They are good when you eat them. It tastes like cinnamon, stuff like that, but it does have an aftertaste. Now, if you add milk with this, because I don't drink milk either, y'all. If you add milk with this, it might be um, better, but it's not bad at all. It's really not. So I'm gonna put this in first place. All right, so now let's try the, let's get some water. I really don't think it's a bad alternative. I don't know if it's a French toast type of cereal out there that they trying to get an alternative to, but I don't know. And I actually think it might be good with some milk, almond milk, something like that. So this is the blueberry muffin. These are the macros. Let's see. Here's the bag. Try three of these as well, y'all. I mean, excuse my chewing and talking, y'all, but you absolutely get that taste as soon as you um put it in your mouth. These don't smell as well as those did. I mean, it didn't have a smell. These don't have a smell. I don't even know. I don't even know whether to put 
that in first and second place. I'm, I'm, I don't know. I think the French toast might be better than the than the um, than the blueberry muffin. So now let's try the banana muffin. These are the macros. Okay. I think I would buy the French toast before I bought the blueberry muffin. I know that's strange, child, for me. Here is the banana muffin. Tastes a little bit like banana. I mean, smell a little bit like banana. So here it is. One more time, y'all. And again, these are the banana muffin. They don't taste better than the French toast, but they do taste better than the blueberry, in my opinion. So the last one is the frosted. And here's the macro. Oops. I'm sorry, y'all. Here's the macros for this one. And y'all, this is how it came all bent up like that. But it could have been the uh, uh, prime, not prime, uh, FedEx or UPS. I brought it, child. I don't know. Here's what they look like. And again, y'all, these are the frosted. Frosted. It's the last one. to get three out each time so here's what the frosty look like definitely don't taste like a frosted cereal like a frosted flake I mean a frosted what are the call what's the tiger call is it Frosty Flakes? Mm -mm. If I was a cereal eater, um, the Frosted and the Blueberry Muffin running the same train. Um, if I was a cereal eater, I would definitely try, and, and trying to do better, I would definitely get this one, the French toast. The French toast. But this here ain't doing it for me, y'all. It ain't doing it for me. But um, I'm definitely going to finish them because it is a healthier snack, like a little finger snack or oh, with cereal. Like I said, it might be better with cereal. I'm going to try to get one of my daughters to try this uh, to see what her opinion is. Um, if not, y'all. They're not just horrible. They really not, but they don't taste like the flavors that the box say, in my opinion. Now they might do better in some milk, but you know, I don't know. But these, if you want to try Magic Spoon, these are really, these are good. These are, they really are. And they taste like something. I don't really eat French toast, but they taste like some of the cinnamon cereal and stuff like that. So. If you want to try Magic Spoon, these are the ones to try, the French Toast. And again, the macros are kind of pretty much the same. That's the macros for that. But yeah, y'all, so um, as far as taste-wise, you know, they're okay. I don't want to give them a bad rap because they're not just not edible, you know? Um, and if you're trying to work on your health and you really love cereal, then I would definitely get these. I really would, but I would just get this, this flavor. But yeah, try them out yourself, y'all, and uh, let me know. Let me know what y'all think if y'all have already tried these. All right, beauties. I will see y'all in the next review.